Hello and welcome back to The Red Napkin. I'm Brian DiCiano. Today I'm presenting to you a drink that I created not too long ago. Um, it's a pretty simple drink uh, based on gin. Gin I'm using today is Tanqueray number 10. This is a fantastic gin. It is so good. Uh, I love it for mar martinis. It's got a really, uh, really pungent, you know, kind of like aggressive, but still very, I mean, it's a sexy gin. Very, very sexy. Uh, it's pungent, it's got a lot of uh, the juniper kind of uh, punch to it, but lots of citrus, and um, it's just a really, really nice gin. Works really well in martinis, and uh, really any other kind of citrus cocktail or you know, long drink or anything like that. So it's really, really a versatile, versatile gin. Um, and uh, I don't know what to call this drink yet. So uh, when I figure out a name for it, I'll just, you know, retitle the video. Okay. So anyways, I'll just get started making this. Uh, I'm going to be using two fresh key limes, juice of two key limes. Each key lime will yield approximately 10 mils uh, through my, you know, using these key limes recently uh, and squeezing them out. I've noticed that pretty consistently you'll get 10 mils per key lime. So this is 20 mils of fresh key lime juice. And then I'm going to match that with some falernum syrup. Now, falernum is a really old school kind of tiki um, ingredient that was, you know, used a lot in rum, rum drinks and tiki era drinks. Uh, I believe like the the alcoholic version is rum based, I believe, and they have like ginger and cloves and lime, and uh, that's pretty much the basic falernum. I think you know some falernums they can add all kinds of other spices and stuff in there but that's pretty much basic. This is a, a non-alcoholic syrup uh, from Fees. So it's got some uh, nice flavor in there and I'm matching that 20 mils slightly under uh, three quarters of an ounce of uh, this falernum. And then I'm adding a full two ounces of this uh, fresh pink grapefruit juice, fresh ruby grapefruit juice. Uh, I, this is like fresh pressed. I just squeezed this out of a, a whole fresh grapefruit and uh, oh, I love grapefruits. Grapefruits are kind of a new, a new uh, passion flavor that I like um, in uh, drinks and just to drink. You know, it's it's tart, but yet not sour, and uh, very fresh. It's just, when it's fresh, it's just amazing. It's awesome. Anyways, and then I'm going to add uh, two ounces of this Tanqueray number 10 into there. And then, to top it all off, Got a dash of grapefruit bitters. This is another ingredient that I've been playing around with. I really like these grapefruit bitters in all kinds of citrus cocktails. So that's pretty much the drink made. All I need to do here is just give it a really good shake and I'm going to serve it on the rocks. You could definitely serve this uh, in a cocktail glass. Um, I kind of adjusted the recipe. Um, to be kind of a little more of a juicy, uh, slightly bigger drink uh, because I was going to be serving it on the rocks. If you want to serve this up, I would say, you know, just adjust the proportions a little differently. You know, I would probably use maybe less gin and a little less uh, grapefruit juice and maybe less lime, less falernum, you know, to equal those out. But, uh, you know, just because, you know, up drinks are, you want it to be a little smaller and a little more. Uh, you want the flavors a little more tight, I guess, is what you want to say, what you want for a, a drink that's up. Anyways, so I'll just add some ice on here. Touch 
more. All right. And I'm going to give this a really good hard shake. This is a good one. And then, serving this nice big rocks glass with the uh, with these really big ice cubes that I really like. It's going to keep the drink really cold and keep it from diluting too much. Fine straining also to keep out all those uh, all those you know little pieces of uh, ice shards and uh, you know grapefruit pulp or lime pulp or anything else that got in there. And then I'm going to garnish on here just to kind of emphasize how fresh this drink is. If I can get this in here with these ice cubes, maybe. Alright. Alright. That'll work. Alright. Fresh, citrusy, spicy, juniper y kind of drink for you. It's a tasty one. I suggest you try it out. Take care. Until next time.